The 2S42 Lotus represents a novel self-propelled mortar system devised for employment by Russian airborne and naval infantry units. Initially unveiled in 2017, a prototype of this artillery system was presented to the public in 2019, marking a pre-production stage. Although its full-scale manufacturing was slated to commence in 2020, this endeavor has faced setbacks, and the prototype necessitates certain design refinements. Upon entering active service, this modern airborne mortar system will take the place of the older Russian 2S9 Nona S, 2S9-1 Spiristelka, and 2S9-1M Nona SM mortar systems. The 2S24 Lotus stands out as a lightweight, transportable, and amphibious vehicle. In comparison to the previous 2S9 series systems, this novel vehicle boasts an extended hull, enhanced ammunition capacity, and superior protective features. Central to this airborne artillery system are attributes like mobility, swift repositioning, and adaptability for air transport. The Lotus is armed with a 120mm breech-loaded mortar that requires manual loading by the loader. This versatile artillery system can function both as a mortar and a howitzer, capable of delivering direct and indirect fire. Employing specialized 120 rifled rounds tailored for Russian mortar systems, including the preceding 2S9 Nona S, as well as standard 120mm mortar mines, it is asserted that the Lotus will also incorporate newly developed rounds designed for increased lethality. The effective firing range extends up to 13 km employing rifled rounds, with a minimum firing distance of 1 km. The prior 2S9 Nona S demonstrated its efficacy in mountainous landscapes during the Soviet war in Afghanistan and the Chechen conflicts, engaging targets inaccessible to conventional artillery due to elevation constraints. The Lotus possesses anti-armored capabilities, with its armor-piercing round capable of penetrating a 600 to 650 mm steel plate at a range of 1000 m. It is also compatible with Kitilov. 2M laser-guided rounds, offering a maximum range of 10 km and a hit probability of approximately 80 to 90 percent. The claimed maximum rate of fire is 6 to 8 rounds per minute, with the main gun carrying a total of 40 rounds of ammunition. The Lotus exhibits increased weight compared to the previous Nona S, resulting in improved survivability. Its frontal section can withstand 12.7 mm rounds, while all-around protection guards against 7.62mm rounds and artillery shell fragments. The vehicle features NBC protection and automatic fire suppression systems. Boasting swift reaction and redeployment times, the Lotus can transition from travel mode to firing position in a mere 30 seconds, and similarly disengage from firing positions to evade counter-battery fire. For defensive purposes, the Lotus is equipped with a remotely controlled weapon station housing a 7.62mm machine gun, complemented by arrays of smoke grenade dischargers for creating smoke screens. Operated by a four-person crew encompassing a commander, gunner, loader, and driver, the 2S42 Lotus artillery system employs an adapted hull from the 2S25 Sprut SD or its newer variant, the Sprut SDM-1 airborne light tank. The vehicle is purportedly driven by a 450 horsepower engine, likely the 2V06-2 diesel employed in the Russian BMD for airborne combat vehicle. This engine output is less potent than that of the airborne light tank, however, the adoption of the UTD-29 diesel engine with 500 horsepower, recently utilized in Russian airborne vehicles like the BMD-4M and BTRMDM, implies a potential redesign of the 2S42 Lotus to accommodate the UTD-29 engine. The engine compartment resides at the rear, and the vehicle's hydropneumatic suspension enables adjustable ground clearance. It can reach a maximum road speed of 70 km per hour and an off-road speed of 30 to 40 km per hour. Being fully amphibious, the 2S42 Lotus employs two water jets for propulsion in aquatic environments, maintaining seaworthiness up to Sea State 3. A Russian IL-76 military transport aircraft has the capability to transport two of these artillery systems. Notably, the 2S42 Lotus can be airdropped with the crew remaining within the vehicle. 
Upon landing, the vehicle can swiftly prepare for operational deployment. Russia is concurrently developing a new airborne artillery fire control vehicle to provide essential targeting data to support the Lotus mortar systems.